It's officially the third day of the winter weather preparedness week. Each day we're giving you tips and tricks on how to stay safe. Today we're talking about the first snow of the year. Every year we see an increase in accidents and that's due to people not really taking the precautions they need to since they're not used to driving in these wintry conditions. Now with that first snow, you're going to want to accelerate and deaccelerate slowly and reduce your speed. These combined are going to be helping you out with that stop time. You're also going to want to have a safety kit packed and prepared that way if you are stranded on the roadways, you're going to have everything you need until emergency services can arrive. Plus, you're going to want to make sure you keep going up that hill. Do not stop because you're going to lose that momentum. You're either going to come right back down that hill or you're going to be stuck at the spot you're at, not being able to get any further. Now, when talking about stopping sides, there's different surfaces and different roads, but typically 35 miles per hour, it's going to take about five to eight seconds for your stop time in snow, which is almost doubling what it would be like during a dry condition scenario. So giving yourself that extra time in those slower speeds going to help you out to keep you safe to avoid any other cars or hazards on the roadways. Now, before you're heading out, you don't want to make maybe a little bit of checklist and kind of go through this. You're going to want to check your local forecast. Make sure you have the ABC 17 Storm Track weather app for your up to date forecast on conditions. Make sure you go ahead and fill that gas tank, especially as the temperatures continue to decrease. decrease. You're going to want to keep that water vapor back out of that gas tank as it'll freeze and cause some issues and make sure you let everybody else know where you're going to be going. That way you have somebody else to check on you if you are not arriving at your location at a specific time. That with that emergency supply kit going to help keep you safe and if you are stranded, remain in the vehicle. I'm ABC 17 Storm Track Meteorologist Chance Scotch.